Welcome back to the channel everybody. I hope you're all doing good. Today we are going to talk about doing timing sync on standalones and what happens if you have no plug wires or you can't get a timing light on an ignition lead. Obviously this one we can but I'm going to use it as an example because it's pretty easy and I have to do timing sync anyway. So let's get to it. So going to need some tools. Obviously we need a timing light. Preferred is one that will work with distributorless ignition. If you have a non-CDI box, which is what this particular one is, you can get the, the pickup, oh, as it slips down, you can get the pickup around the wires and you can get an inductive signal. The CDIs make it really difficult. So what we do is we get some DSM plug wires. We pull the little leads off. We're gonna jam them into here. On each of them one two three four in order put them in the motor I'm gonna electrical tape them so that we can grab this the actual spark plug wire and get accurate timing sync so the other thing is you need to make sure that down in there where your crank pulley is you have TDC marked in white otherwise it's gonna be really difficult and you're not gonna do it accurately um, other thing is this car does not have a battery you can use a jump pack, you can use any stable 12 volt source, you can put it to the back of the alternator, it's up to you. But obviously it has to get powered on that gator and that gator. So I'm gonna move to the next step. Okay, so for sake of discussion, this is what I was talking about with the jump pack. That's gonna be my 12 volt power source, and then obviously that goes to number one. Okay, so if you look down in there, you can kind of see a white dot bouncing around just a little bit. This is with the timing locked at zero. It's moving one or two degrees even though it's locked. So I'll probably pull one out just to be safe. Lost the focus there for a second. Anyway, that's the basic operation. This doesn't matter what standalone you have. This is pretty much universal. You might just adjust it differently in the software. We can talk about that later. Okay guys, take care. 